Good afternoon, I'm Chuck Pierce and you're watching Smart Trend News. Today is Friday, December 2nd, and this is your market close wrap up. The major U.S. equity indices closed relatively flat Friday after the U.S. unemployment rate plummeted to its lowest level in more than two years. The U.S. economy created 120,000 jobs in the private sector in November, and the unemployment rate fell to 8.6 percent. The reduction in the jobless rate, which stood at 9 percent in October, stemmed in large part from a decline in the size of the labor force, the Labor Department reported. Some 315,000 people stopped looking for jobs last month. In corporate news, Japanese car maker Honda Motor announced a recall of 304,000 vehicles globally for airbags that may inflate with too much pressure in a crash. The Accord, Civic, Odyssey, Pilot, CRV, and other Honda models manufactured in 2001 and 2002 are affected by the recall. The automaker said there have been 20 accidents so far related to the airbag issue, including two deaths in the U.S. in 2009. And finally, Facebook game maker Zynga is moving forward with its initial public offering, saying it could raise up to $925 million. The company plans to sell 100 million shares, or 14.3 percent of the company, at $8.50 to $10 per share, according to a regulatory filing. This would value the five-year-old company at around $7.7 to $9.04 billion, based on 904 million fully diluted shares, which would catapult it to the top of the U.S. game industry. Now, taking a look at where the markets closed today, the Dow Jones Industrial Average closed 0.01% lower at 12,019. The S&P 500 closed 0.02% lower at 1,244. And the Nasdaq Composite closed 0.03% higher at 2,626. This has been your market close wrap-up for Friday, December 2nd. I'm Chuck Pierce. Stay tuned for more insight into the financial sector here at Smart Trend News.